our lessons on the verb to be. If you are a new comma, if you are a new, if you are a learner, a, a beginner, a fresh learner, a new learner of English language, now we are looking at how to start making sentences, how to start speaking, how to start writing. We have seen something, how to start, if you want to start now, that is present, if you want to talk about now, or if you want to talk about the past. If you want to talk about now, or you want to talk about the past, we have seen that past and present. Present and past. Now, how do you start if you want to talk about the future? Things that are coming or things that will come. Things that are in the future. How do you start? Look at that. You start as, remember the subject, the verb, and you continue. I shall be. You will be. I shall be. You will be. He. He for a man or a boy. He will be. He for a man or a boy. Look at this. Jude. Let's take Jude to be a boy or a man. Jude will be. She. If you're a woman, a girl, or a lady, she will be. Or let's take that girl or that woman or that lady to be Agnes. Agnes will be. It will be. It can be anything. Book, shirt, fan, mobile, fruit, and so on. It will be. The fan will be. We, including myself there, we shall be. Or I and James shall be. They are not included. They will be. You are not included if the one speaking. They will be. The oranges will be. Now you see, I shall be coming to the house. I shall be coming to the house. You write it, I shall be there. I shall be there. I shall be there. Okay? I shall be there. I shall be there soon. I shall be there. Remember, shall be. I shall be there soon. You will be. You will be coming to see us. You will be coming to see us. You will be coming to the house. You will be coming to the house. You will be. He will be going out. He will be going out now. He will be going out. He will be going out. He, man, or a boy. Let's take that to be Jude. Jude will be visiting us. Jude will be visiting us. She, a girl, a man, a woman, a lady, she will be traveling soon. She will be traveling. She will be traveling. Oh, she will be traveling. She will be traveling. Okay? Agnes will be, Agnes will be traveling. Agnes will be calling soon. Agnes will be calling us. Will be calling them. Uh oh, Agnes will be calling them. Or oh, Agnes will be calling. Now it, it will be fine. It will be fine. It will be fine. Look at the fan. The fan will be walking. The fan will be walking. The fan, we are talking about something in future. The fan will be walking. We shall be, we shall be, we shall be going out. We shall be going out. Look at that. I and James shall be, I and James shall be killing them, shall be killing, shall be killing them. I and James shall be killing them. Remember, if you can put James and I, if it's something that is not a crime, if it's something that is not an offense, if it's not an offense, you put James before you put I. James and I. 
But now, because it's an offense, I put I and then before James. I and James shall be killing them. Now look at it. They will be, there will be what? They will be smoking cigarettes. They will be smoking. They will be smoking cigar. Okay? The oranges will be, the oranges will be sweet. The oranges will be sweet. Now you see how you can make sentences in future. You can make sentences in future, future tense. That is how to start. How to start. How do you start? If you want to, if you're a new person, you want to start to say something that is coming. I shall be there soon. I will be I shall be traveling. I shall be calling you. I shall be moving to town. I shall be going to this place. Look at that. Shall be. Future tense. You will be coming to the house. Look at will be. Remember, will be in red. Look at that. I shall be there soon. You will be coming to the house. He will be going out. Jude will be visiting us. She will be traveling. Agnes will be calling them. It will be fine. The fan will be walking. We shall be going out. I and Jeff shall be killing them. They will be smoking cigarettes. The oranges will be sweet. You see how you can put something in the future, something that is coming. How you are going to start to make the sentence. How you can start your grammar if you are a new beginner. I shall be, you will be, he will be, Jude will be, she will be, Agnes will be, it will be, the fan will be, we shall be, I and Jen shall be, they will be, the oranges will be. And so that is how to start that in future tense. Now we are also going to look at how to start that in present perfect. In present perfect, look at that. On the left hand side, future tense. On the right hand side, present perfect. Join us as we explain that in the next video how to use, how to start your grammar. How to start your grammar. Key starters. How to start your grammar in the present perfect. Join us in the next video. Share, subscribe, and give us a thumbs up.